It's well known that Sokolov is virtually addicted to a rare liquor called King Street Brandy. The taste is revolting, but I happen to have a bottle. However, I am reluctant to give it to you for Sokolov. It cost me quite a lot. It is very expensive stuff, a blend of rare Pendician spices and a drop of whale oil. Would you care to purchase it? Attention Dunwall citizens, be aware that looting of evacuated areas is a... I could use a drink. King Street Brandy? I didn't know any more existed. It is an extraordinary gift. I see I'm dealing with men of taste. I can tell you this much. She was always referred to as Lady Boyle. I painted her to be sure, but I never saw her face or learned her first name. You see, I painted her from behind. I assure you, she still makes a striking portrait. But I do not know which Boyle she is. I was to be introduced to her at a masked ball in her honor this very night. But I will miss that party, it seems. A masked ball at the Boyle Estate. Tonight, the timing is perfect, Corvo. But the Boyles are wealthy and ruthless, so security will be very tight. Of course, you already have a mask, don't you, Corvo? He's right. You will be able to mingle with them once you're on the ground. You'll have to find out which of the Boyle women is connected to the Lord Regent and take her out in whatever way you can devise. We're very close now. If you do this tonight, we'll be able to strike at the Lord Regent himself and put Emily on the throne. May the wind favor you. I hear you're off to the Boyle's little bash tonight. I have just a tiny favor I'd like to ask you. Could you give this note to Lord Shaw? You'll know him. A rather brusque man wearing a wolf's mask. In fact, he may be looking for me. Consider the Boyle costume ball, huh? Well, that'll be fun, but not for everybody. You ready? I didn't think there'd be tall boys patrolling here tonight. Watch yourself, Corvo. They don't fool around. The good news is, once you get to the party, that mask of yours lets you blend right in. Enjoy your evening out with the folk of quality. Better you than me.
you, most sir, people don't with remember. The hand tattoo. The Are you sure? That's not how I remember. Excuse me. You, a gentleman? I'll have you know. <laughs> Bless you. Don't be silly. The rumors say the Boyles practically own your... There's something disturbing about that mask. Harold dies. Should we gather for whiskey and cigars tonight? Never doubt. Grimm, you'll never... What is it now? She had her jobber pick up a boy in the street, barely 16 years old. No family there. I thought her interests were confined to her. Careful. We tried for a peek upstairs and the man was... I should have talked some manners. This party is a sham. I'm sure... I know your mission tonight. We must speak. Privately. Ooh, scary mask. Excuse me. Oh, leave him be. It's a pot. I say nothing against the Lord Regent. Excuse me. Will it never end? Evening, sir. You should see this as an opportunity. To what? Learn a trade, join the... Hold on, I need a cigar. could do when it made us an empire. This is the beginning of a golden age. Do you know they've dug down and found the ruins of another city under this one? Excuse me a moment. No guests past this point.
Hope you enjoyed your evening, sir. But we'd best be on our way. Quickly. Pendleton said he would meet us here. I checked the wine cellar. Losing family gives a man a thirst. did it. And now we've done away with a woman and a noble woman at that. But Boyle was a viper. She helped the Lord Regent kill the Empress. So I don't feel a thing for her. I've heard from Lord Shaw this morning, which means my note was not delivered. This puts me in an awkward position. But then, you weren't the one who said his wife had the face of a plague rat. Thank you. I will try not to overburden you in future missions. You've had a long night, Corvo. But I fear it's not over. Havelock and Martin have already cooked up something more for you. They would like to see you now, in Havelock's chambers above the bar. Attention, Dunwall citizens. The streets adjacent to Boyle Manor remain off-limits pending an ongoing investigation. Corvo, the time has come. Everything we have done, everything that you have done, has served to make this moment possible. The Lord Regent is exposed, Corvo. Vulnerable. And now everything is in place to strike at him. We're one step from the throne. One man, one beating heart, is all that's left of the forces that brought this city to the brink of ruin. It is simple, but it will be far from easy. The Lord Regent's paranoia has reached an all-time high. He has lost the support of the Overseers, the Parliament, his financial base, and he's lost Sokolov, who made his security technology. So at Dunwall Tower, he has consolidated every remaining loyal man around him. He knows something is coming. He knows you are coming. And everything depends on him being correct. Piero will help you prepare. Then Samuel will take you close to the tower, near the waterlock. Last time you were there was the horrible day that all of this started. Now you will go there and end it. Good luck, Corvo. I'm not sure what else we could say, other than our hopes are riding on you. You've come very far, Corvo. We are almost there. Hello, love. Ready to face the Lord Regent? About time we took care of my say. Long past time. The 
This is it, Corvo. Your last memories of Dunwall Tower might not be good ones, huh? So maybe you can make up for what happened back then. It'll be a bit of a climb from the water lot. Most important thing is killing the Lord Regent. Built himself quite a place at the top of the tower. Calls it his safe room or something. Crazy if you ask me. Another point of interest while I'm giving you the grand tour, Corvo. Broadcast control station here where all them announcements come from. Might be worth looking into. You ready? Next time I see you, the Lord Region will be dead. And if not, well, it was an honor to serve with you. Attention Dunwall Tower personnel. All new assignments report directly to the duty officer. Should we gather for whiskey and cigars tonight? Indeed, I believe so. Attention Dunwall Tower personnel. Remain on post until you receive further orders. If the plague were to take the entire city, or flames consumed, Dunwall Tower would be the last to fall. is secure on the grounds, Lord Regent. It won't hurt to check again. I'm going to head down and retire to my bedroom. Begging your pardon, sir, but I think it would be best if you stay in your safe room on the roof for now. I need the comfort of my own bed tonight. Trust you with your men to handle the tower security. Yes, as you wish, Lord Regent. I'm heading up. Keep this area secure and use that alarm if there's any sign of trouble. Yes, sir.
citywide ban on whale oil is now in effect. Citizens are encouraged to bring any whale oil in their p Please, please don't hurt me. You're here to kill the regent, aren't you? Spare my life, and I can help you beat him. He makes recordings on audiograph, secrets. Some that would destroy him if others heard. Played on this amplifier, his confessions will be broadcast throughout the city. He'll be ruined. The audiograph card you want is in a safe in the Lord Regent's room. But I was able to see the combination over his shoulder. 935. Trust me, what's recorded on that card will do the trick. Good luck. If I explain, then you will see I am not at fault. My poverty eradication plan was meant to bring prosperity to the city, to rid us of those scoundrels who waste their days in filth and drink without homes or occupations other than to beg for the coin for which the rest of us toil. And it was a simple plan. What are you doing? disease-bearing rats Is it all done? You ready to go back to the Hound Pits? <laughs> <laughs> 